With the change to the Finance Bill 2019, citizens will receive a full refund after purchasing their solar water heaters. Minister of Finance Kalm Imbert explained that citizens will be able to claim 100% of the cost of the water heater as a tax credit. So let's say the water heater costs $8,000, you can claim $8,000 as a tax credit. If it costs $5,000, you can claim $5,000. And we're taking that up to a maximum of ten. So we're leaving the 10000 unchanged, but we are changing the quantum of the tax credit. The tax credit is now the full amount. Clause 2 of the bill amends the Income Tax Act, which deals with the solar water heaters. Minister Imbert said currently citizens can claim 25% of their expenditure on a solar water heater up to a maximum of $10,000. Now, the <coughs> cost of a typical residential solar water heater would be less than $10,000. So at the present time, let's assume your average person acquiring a solar water heater would get a tax a tax. Uh, deduction or tax credit, tax credit, sorry, of maybe two thousand dollars, a thousand dollars. Let's assume the solar water heater would cost four thousand dollars, even eight thousand dollars. You can get twenty-five percent of that. He said government is hoping to develop a similar system like Trinidad and Tobago's regional neighbor Barbados. It's a phenomenon that's very evident in Barbados. Nearly every house in Barbados has a solar water heater on the top of it, and. Um, the Barbados government, in fact, subsidizes the cost of solar water heaters, which is something we may wish to look at in the future as we move towards renewable energy in terms of providing some of the electric power that is required for an ordinary home. Minister Imbert said the credit will be more than adequate and should encourage the public to move to solar for water heating. Mahalia Joseph Wharton, TTT News.